Thousands of people showed up to honor Detective Jerry Walker today during a processional for the fallen officer from Little Elm. A viewing was held tonight at a church in Plano as a community works to make sure Detective Walker is never forgotten. Our Brittany Jeffers live in Little Elm tonight. Kaylee, behind me, you can see the candles, the flowers, and the notes that just continue to grow at this memorial outside of PD in Little Elm for Detective Walker. But there's a lot of people in the area who are paying their respects in other ways. And they say that it, they hope that it will continue after that funeral tomorrow. You could see them from the air and out on the streets he served. Officer Walker had a large impact on a lot of people here. Other first responders next to those with the smallest salutes. He served us. He served us. People lined up for miles in honor of fallen officer Detective Jerry Walker. Just being able to remember and show respect and unify as a city. Showing unity through their grief with other acts. Literally every other tree is lined with a nice big blue bow. There was no more blue ribbon. There was no more blue material in Little Elm, Texas. Kim Schumacher went to another city to find more ribbon and then helped cut and tie more than 120 of them. They span the stretch of the processional, and she hopes drivers will be reminded of him. The impact of what he gave to us. Every time they see one blowing in the wind. And Officer Walker was that big of a personality here. He had a way to connect with everybody, so I wanted to keep that alive. 633. Because of Jake Jacobson's help, Detective Walker's badge number will stay proudly displayed on cars. Many, many people, literally from all over the nation. But just in the neighborhood, we literally cannot keep up. People keep asking, and we cannot make them fast enough. A community now covered with precious reminders of an officer who lost his life in the line of duty. Funeral services for Detective Walker will take place tomorrow morning at 10 a.m. in Plano. Reporting live tonight in Little Elm, I'm Brittany Jeffers, CBS 11 News. Brittany, thank you. A plane